All right, this one's gonna be on bash mount. It is a menu-based script to mount your devices. So this bus is out here, bash mount, and you can see uh, this is like the menu layout here. So the top one here is your internal media, like your hard drives that's mounted on boot and stuff like that. Uh, here it has optical media. Now if you plug in like um, your USB stick, it will have like a removable media here in this menu. Let me plug in my USB here. So, all right, so we'll wait for it to uh, connect a little bit, and uh, you know, if you're already running the script, you can actually just uh, hit R for refresh here. So we'll hit R and then push Enter, and it'll refresh it. And you can see now it will detect the uh, removal media, aka your USB sticks and stuff like that. Anyways, um, if you want to mount this. Uh, anytime you see like a little star next to this, that means you have to have like, a number before it. So if I wanted to use this device, I'll hit like 7 and M, you know, 7 and U, 7 and E or something like that. All right. Um, that's what we're going to do. Okay. So right now it's not mounted because the part right here, like these ones, you can see that it's mounted on, you know, different paths. Right here, we're not mounted yet. It detects it, but it's not mounted yet. So what we want to do is 7 and M for mount and you see it says mounted successfully uh, at uh, was that run media username and then the uh, name of the USB stick here which is uh, PS3 exploit same thing in here right um, and that's it so we did enter and now if I bust out like Ranger or something like that and I'm gonna go to that path you can see that we're in our run media username and uh, we have our PS3 Exploit, aka our USB stick here, right? Uh, if I want to unmount it, I'll do the same thing, 7 and then U for unmount. And you see now uh, this folder or this uh, USB uh, path should be empty because we unmounted. Um, other stuff you can do. Well, if you want to get the help page here, you can do question mark. And it basically tells you whatever the hell we just did or uh, I just demonstrated how. Anyways, uh, they do have eject, which is used for, I guess, ejecting the uh, DVD drive or stuff like that. And also, like, for ejecting your um, USB sticks. So let's say if you're mounted and you want to unmount and eject at the same time, you can use this one, right? So let's say, for example, if I mount it again, 7 and M right so you can see that it's mounted here now if I want to just like unmount it and eject it at the same time I can do 7 and an E and you'll see that I'll say unmount successfully and then right now it's gonna eject the um, what was that the USB sticks also All right so I'm waiting for it to reload and now you see there's no more removable media it's just you know they only have like internal and optical media now Anyways, that's pretty much it for the program. Uh, should be in your repositories if you have like a, an Arch system. Uh, other places, you you know, you probably have to go download it manually. Anywho, pretty cool little script. If you want to mount and unmount stuff quickly, uh, that'd be it for this one.